Hi, I'm Michael with Impact Care Therapy. Are you a runner who has pain on the bottom side of your foot right here? In this video, we're going to be going over five different exercises that you can do to help reduce that pain. So when we have pain on the bottom of our foot, a lot of times when we're running, that happens because the tissue here gets overstretched. And so what we need to do is we need to get those muscles within the foot to work a little harder and to be a little tighter. So that's why we're going to be doing these exercises. Okay, the first exercise that we're going to do is called the tennis ball roll up. So really this is focusing on the bottom part of your foot, right where it's hurting. So what you're going to do is you're going to stand up, you're going to have the ball on the ground, and you're going to roll the ball right over the spots that are hurting. And really try to get close to that middle part of the foot and then put as much weight as you can. It should feel a little discomfort, but afterwards it'll feel better. And if you find a spot, you can do little circles around it if you find the spot that's really hurting. You can do this for about 30 seconds to a minute. You can walk and see if it feels any different. The second exercise is a big toe stretch. So you can grab a rope or if you have at home a belt or a dog leash or a towel and you're going to wrap your big toe just like that and you're gonna pull back. And you really wanna feel a stretch right here. And you're gonna hold that for about 30 seconds, and then you can relax. You can do this about three times. Now this is gonna be a really challenging one. What you have to do is you have to keep your big toe on the mat while you raise up your other three, four toes. And then you put the other four toes down and then you keep the four toes down while you raise up the big toe. So you're alternating between the big toe being down and then the other toes being up and then the big toe being up and the other toes being down. So this is going to take a lot of control and you might not get it initially and if that's okay, what you can do is you can use your hand to help kind of guide you. But as you get better at it, you can start letting go of the foot. Have the muscles really control toes. The fourth exercise is called the medial arch raise. So what you're going to do is you're going to have your foot kind of relaxed and what you're going to have is something to put under your foot right here. So that way you should feel the item underneath your foot. Next, you're going to push your toes down into the mat and in order to make the arch of your foot rise up. So you should really feel the object when you're relaxed and then when you contract the muscle, you're going to raise that arch up and hold it for about five seconds and then relax. Up, hold, hold, hold. Up, really contract. You should feel it all in here. And then relax. Don't curl your toes. You're pushing the toes down into the mat, but you're not curling them. The final exercise is toe squeezes. So what you're going to do is you're going to grab a pencil or a pen and you're going to put that right between your toe, your big toe and the next toe, and you're going to squeeze. Then you're going to open up your other toes and you're going to pass it to the other foot, just like that. And you're going to squeeze on the other foot, hold it there for a second, and then you're going to pass it back, just like that. 
So you really want to be able to hold the pencil kind of higher on the toes rather than putting it, kind of letting it rest on the bottom. You want to grab and squeeze just like that. So there's a little space between my toes. Grab, squeeze. Grab, squeeze. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and these exercises, and also share this with a friend if they have any pain on the bottom of their foot. We'll see you in the next video.